and it's official. A kid-friendly Universal Studios theme park is coming to Frisco. City Council approved the plan last night despite pushback from dozens of nearby homeowners who wanted the vote delayed so that their concerns could be addressed. Our Nick Starling joins us now live with the latest developments. Nick, what can you tell us? Well, this was a 4-2 vote from City Council. Much of that pushback coming from the adjacent Cobb Hill neighborhood, who just didn't feel like their concerns were being heard. However, there's a lot of other people that are very excited that this theme park is coming to Frisco. Now, Universal wants to build a kid-focused amusement park on 97 acres of the north end of Frisco by the North Dallas Tollway and Panther Creek Parkway, as well as a 300-room hotel. Now, this theme park will also bring big to the city. During a final presentation last night, the city council heard about the park generating $3 million a year in sales and property taxes, along with more than $1 million a year in hotel taxes. Those who live in a nearby Cobb Hill neighborhood worry the park will be an eyesore that will bring traffic and crime and will ultimately lower their property values. The council voted to approve the zoning requests needed for construction to move forward. I feel like the council has rubber stamped this. I don't feel like we're being heard. I don't think that planning and zoning is listening to all of the concerns. What our next step is probably going to have to be is to try to get signatures for a referendum. From every aspect, it'll be uh, something that I think that the city of Frisco uh, will be proud of. The city council also approved $12 million in financial incentives to secure this project. The steam park could open up as early as 2026. Live in Frisco, Nick Starling, CBS News, Texas. Nick, a lot of people uh, for the project, obviously, and there are those that are against it. Going to be a wild ride to the finish.